Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to undo as many times as you want in Adobe Photoshop and how simple it is to do. As most of you already know, pressing Command Z on a Mac or Control Z on a Windows machine, it will undo what you just did. Let me show you what I'm talking about. We'll take a shape here, take a dog paw, draw it out. Now if I press Command Z because I'm on a Mac, which will be Control Z on a Windows machine, it will undo what I just did. However, my last move that I just did was an undo. So if I hit Command Z again, it will undo my undo. So technically it will be redoing my undo. So I'll hit Command Z, so you just undid your undo. So technically it was a redo. It's not an official redo because you're just undoing what you just undid, if that makes sense. So let me add a few more shapes here. A check mark, we'll just draw it out here. A heart, we'll draw one here, a pair of scissors, and I'll put these scissors here. All right, so now we have four shapes that we just drew. We want to undo that heart that we just did. You know, for some reason, we don't like it. You know, we don't really want the scissors either, so we're just going to go ahead and press Control Z or Command Z on Mac to undo. So we got rid of the scissors. If you hit Command Z again, you're expecting to continue going backwards, and you think you're going to remove the heart. So hit Command Z again, uh, and you get the scissors back. So this might start frustrating some people if they can't get back. You'll just hit Control Z, Control Z, Command Z, Command Z. So if you don't know why it's doing it, you're probably going to get frustrated. Have no fear. It's quite simple to continue backing up your edits. Instead of pressing Control or Command Z, all you have to do is toss in an Alt or an Option in addition to the Command or Control. So let's try it out. Let's back up these undos. To undo the first one, press Command Z or Control Z on a PC and it undoes the last thing you did. Now press Command and Option on a Mac, or press Control and Alt on a PC, and then press the Z key while holding the other two keys down. Voila, you just went further back in your undos. Also, just to point out, for the first undo, you can start off with Command, Option, Z, or Control, Alt, Z. You don't have to start off with just Command or Control, Z. So let me undo my check mark too by holding Command, Option, Z. And I get rid of the check mark as well. So then you say to yourself, you know what? I kind of did want that check mark there. Well, that's fine. You can actually step forward in your undo history by pressing Command Shift Z or Control Shift Z on Windows to redo your undos. So you can step back and step forward however you please. So now you can undo as many times as you would like, or at least until you reach your undo limit. If you want to learn how to increase your undo limit, Check out my next video explaining how to do that here. I hope this has helped you out. Send me a message if you need to or leave it in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.